Dudes and dudes and dudettes, trunks coming right back at you with something new. He's doing something new. No, well, yeah, I am actually, but what's really cool about this video is I am playing on my Xbox One. What? Well, how is he doing that? It's a little thing called technology. If you don't know about it, learn it. Anyhow, I'm going to go uh, just kind of play a little bit of Destiny in the background as we talk about different stuff and things that are happening in our lives. Um, in my life in particular, I think what I'm going to do is uh, head into here because I have some stuff I got. Oh, wait, hold on. Is there anything I can upgrade? Oh, snap, I got weapons. Okay, this is my special weapon. Sniper rifle. I should probably equip that, huh? All right, let's equip that. Sweet. Um, oh, there's new stuff over here. Arm. Sweet. Twenty-five, eighteen. Is that the highest one? All right. Yep, highest one. Okay. Chest armor. Come on now. Right now I've got a thirty-four. So thirty-three. To, well, well, that's kind of a little bit too much right now. All right, so 34, which is what I have. Okay, that's cool. Um, let's look at my legs. Um, based on the feel for the Can't use it. Level 29. Okay, so just a bunch of teasing going on there. Goodness gracious. All right, let's launch this. <clears throat> so check it out. I am gonna start doing console commentary recording gameplay playthroughs things and yes that is the technical name that we're going with because I made it up I like it and you have to deal with it and if you don't then just turn off the video yeah. well, well don't the video. you should definitely, definitely stay the subscribe button because I'm about to blow your mind I'm gonna add webcam yep guys that's right I'm gonna add webcam to my videos that's another important. A uh, technical thing, uh, uh, if you don't know about, you can just educate yourself. Probably start tomorrow. Go ahead and start educating yourself tomorrow. Okay, I'm a noob. I'm a total noob to this game, if you couldn't tell already. Can I use my sniper rifle? Yes. How do I look in? Oh, this is great. So I can just do things like this. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome, sir. Don't I don't have any bullets. I should probably not do all that. Okay. So, well, I am a complete noob um, when it comes to this game. Because, you know, I just got it and I was like, I need to start recording some videos and stuff and things. So, the that's what I'm doing. need a little research help, Guardians. You'll got to decrypt this message. Uh, headshot. Are you really still alive? Okay. No, not a bullet. Hey, 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 hey. So yeah, as I uh, as I'm playing, I just wanted to talk to you guys about a couple things. Um, first things first. Um, I'm a realist. Um, drop this and uh, let the whole world hear it. <laughs> That's a song, guys. Laugh, it's funny. Songs are funny. And, and guys, that's um, never mind. Anyways, what's this thing? Do I need it? No. So what am I doing? I'm trying to find answers, and I gotta go this way. Okay. So, yes, I'm adding webcam, which is super exciting. I'm so excited to do that because then you can guys can see me, and it can be a good thing or a bad thing. You're welcome. Um, and if it's a bad thing, then I'm sorry. It's good. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Let me get back on on track with this. Um, no, no. Die, mo, mo. Oh, truck and move, truck and dad, dad. All right, so where is that guy going? I haven't found any sensors. Apparently, I gotta go here. Do I gotta go far or something? How do I do that, little guy? Oh, little guy. How far do I have to go? Tell me. Scan the fallen sensors and transmit the data back to the grip tarp. Alright, so maybe that's why that guy went inside, because he knew what he was doing. <laughs> I'm so glad I picked the sniper rifle, so I'm going to be using it a lot. Anyways, 
So I am super, super excited to uh, bring this to you guys and have some webcam action. I don't really know exactly how that's going to go, but <clears throat> generally the kind of, the consensus, consensus, that's a technical word, um, it's one of those things you can do research on later, um, the, the general consess, consensus, gosh, it's also a very hard word, um, is that people want webcam, so I don't know. If you guys want it, then it'll come, but if you don't, then I can get rid of it. It's not that big of a deal to me. Look at these. Oh, I already did this mission before. Yes, I'm not very good at the technical shots, but I guess the points or whatever. These things aren't even like high level, so I should be going quick. So I hope you guys like that. Um, other than that, I'm just uh, I'm gonna try some new games. Some games, games I haven't tried before. Um, I started playing first-person shooter games. Well, I, I'm, I'm I'm in my 30s, so you know I played the 80s video game consoles. Those were like my my uh, my game consoles. So when the Nintendo 64 did come out. They blew everybody off with 007. Um, if you guys don't know what that is, check it out in Nintendo 64 007. You might laugh because it's it by the standards it looks horrible. The controls are are, are not good, but uh, it was kind of the first, you know, the first of its kind. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So we got that count going. Da -da -da. I had that going for me, and then. Once I was out of high school, I think, like, fresh out of high school, uh, the Xbox came out. And at first I didn't get the Xbox, I was doing the PlayStation thing because Sony blew everybody's mind. Isn't there supposed to be, like, a guy coming through there? Um, Sony, like, blew everybody's mind with the PlayStation, so I got that. I was playing games like Twisted Metal. And I kind of got away from first-person shooter until Halo. When the new Xbox came out, <clears throat> and uh, we had huge LAN parties at my house, and back then, you know, there wasn't like the thin panel TVs. People were bringing stinking those huge old school box, uh, you know, tube TVs. And uh, oh, I scanned a sensor. Great. Good work. Um, mission complete. That's it, huh? Wow, that was easy. Um. So yeah, we had these huge LAN parties and we played all night long. I remember we would be like, it'd be like four or five in the morning. You know, the sun's coming up over here on the west coast, and we're just like, whatever, let's keep playing. And then we'd hear like the school bus outside coming to pick up the kids. Oh my gosh, true story. Um, and we just keep playing, and it was so much fun. It was so much fun. Um, but, you know, there was the, the online multiplayer thing didn't exist back then. That wasn't a thing. We had, um, we had normal, uh, um, I think I should just jump into the, uh, jump into, like, multiplayer. I think I opened that now. Yeah, so, like, you know, there was no online massive multiplayer anything, you know, um, I think the first online first-person shooter I played was Counter-Strike on the PC. And, uh, you know, that was another mind-blowing experience. Um, but anyways, then Halo 2 came out and we got entered to it. And, you know, Microsoft and Bungie, you know, for the, for the most part, I think they did an amazing job with that initial server because, in my opinion, that was the server that... or that was kind of the server that really kicked off the massive online multiplayer was Halo 2 uh, multiplayer, but is this where I go? Crucible? Own your skills and glory against other guardians. Okay, yeah. Um, oh, what do I do? Flash, competitive multiplayer. Um, control, what's it, what, what the balls? Six versus six, fire. Um, get, I, get, get re, I can get rewards and XP. Let's just do this one. Um, so yeah, and then after Halo 2 came out, um, I was actually preparing to uh, deploy. I was in the army at the time, and I was getting ready for my deployment. <clears throat> and I uh, 
I also noticed at the time that there was another game coming out around this. It was around the same time Halo 3 came out called of Call of Duty, but this wasn't the Call of Duty we were all used to playing all the time, that, where it was all about the single player experience. It was Call of Duty 4. Or, excuse me, Modern Warfare. The, the first Modern Warfare. I don't remember what they called it. It was Modern Warfare 4 or 1 or whatever the heck. I'm not a Call of Duty person. Um, anyway, so that was really cool because we had an opportunity to play that while it's deployed. Obviously, we couldn't play on the, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, online. We had to play, you know, again, land connected to each other's laptops, which is really cool. It was, it was, it was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. Um, and it's funny we're playing a war game as we're literally out doing war. <laughs> but uh, anyways, I don't, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. You guys, I'm having to run into my death. Oh jeez. Um, apparently that color. Alright, so it was a really great experience. And I gotta change my weapon. Can I change my weapon? Zone B neutralized. Zone C secure. Zone B secure. Heavy ammo on the way. So when we got back from our deployment, um, you know, some of the single soldiers in the barracks, we got to go. Oh my gosh, that's like my first kill ever. Heavy ammo available. Um, can I revive this guy? Oh, I'm dead. That was fun. <laughs> that noob. Okay, so, what are we talking about? Multiplayer stuff, so great, so yeah. We, uh, we started doing the whole Halo thing, which was just amazing, we all loved it, we all had a blast. Um, and we, and then the, the game, uh, was the Call of Duty World at War, I think it was. They, like, went back to, like, the World War II stuff. And we, we got that, and the only reason we got it was to play zombies. Now that's where my, like, walk with Call of Duty ends, because zombies was just, like, what it was all about for me at that point on, um, which was hilarious. So we did that, and then we, uh, none of us really, I mean, we got really good at the zombies, but none of us really continued to play the, uh, other stuff. Oh, I just, I don't know who you, they're gonna know right where to find me. Enemy captured zone C. Yeah, you get used to the, the radar is oh, that's not good. I'm dead. Obviously. Yeah, so we just played a ton of that, and that was a lot of fun. Um, and then um, I got out of the military, and a little game called Medal of Honor came out, which was amazing. I loved the way the weapons sound. They were super accurate. Um, just everything. It, it wasn't as fantasized as Zone Modern C. Warfare Secure. was, and yes, well Modern done. Warfare, believe it or not, was fantasized. The there was a lot of extra fantasism in it. Sweet, I won. It was, it was because I joined the game that they won. But anyway, mm. that's what kind of brought me into first-person shooter. Now I'm picking the controller back up and trying to get back into it. There'll still be Minecraft videos and all that other stuff, so don't worry. Um, but I just wanted to do something a little different and talk to you guys a little bit about some weird random stuff going through my mind. And uh, that's about all I got for you guys. So thanks so much for watching. Um, let me know what you think in the comments below. Even if it's bad, I need to hear it. And uh, as always, if you liked the video or didn't like it, hit the subscribe button because I'll bring content that you either love or you hate. But either way, you will be entertained. So love, peace, and chicken grease. I will see you guys on the flip side.